Hey, it's me, Donnie. Welcome back to my channel. And today we're talking apparel, essential apparel. The brand today that I am unboxing from is Versace. The first time I ever ordered from Versace was in my first cheapest video for the brand. I unboxed from Essence and they sent me underwear. If you haven't seen that video, I'll make sure to link it. Love the underwear to be completely honest with you. And actually I've slowly been making the switch to some luxury pieces in my intimates. So like right now as I'm talking to you, I'm actually wearing a Versace sports bra. In that video, you can kind of see my cynicism, one, because of the packaging from Essence, but two, the price point of the underwear. I've had the underwear for a couple of months now and I definitely have to say I enjoy it. And in the future, probably plan to get more pieces from their intimates. They're legit comfortable. I could totally see myself lounging around in these when it's hotter, but in the meantime, they're super functional. I actually have a pride sports bra if you care. I can insert a picture of it because I'm not about to show it on camera as y'all know your girl is in the middle of a weight loss journey. So when I get my snap back right, y'all just wait. Y'all just wait. So I did order from Essence again. The first thing, thing paper, <laughs> if I can get it off. And surprisingly I'm a little perplexed but then again I should have known what the price point it says Versace underwear on it so I'm going to assume that this is an undershirt which is perfectly fine by me I got it in the XL size because I wanted something oversized the material is nice I hope this actually fits like an extra large though you know I know Italian sizing can be a little smaller and as I'm opening this up, this looks really small. I don't know. I was going for an oversized t-shirt look, but I don't think that's gonna happen. And I should have known, cause the models on Essence are so skinty. But here's the shirt. It's got the little Medusa head on it. I just wanted something a little more subtle. So I mean, the Medusa head is there. It's definitely more of that underwear undershirt material I could totally still wear this but I don't know if it's gonna be what it was that I was going for now there's a part of me that's saying girl you should have gotten like a men's yeah yeah I'm having regret <sighs> I mean it does look big but not big enough like <sighs> anyway I'm looking at the size and the size says seven and I'm like really like come on Versace what are you doing this is not an extra large or at least not an American extra large. Maybe this is extra large in Italy, but not. Yeah, I should have gotten a men's. The next thing that I got was a pair of leggings. And they actually come on a Versace garment hanger, which is nice. Ooh, they even put little material there to make sure that the leggings don't get messed up. And these are that stretch material. So I'd imagine that these would be flattering now, even at my larger size. I got a size 44, which I think converts to about a 10. To zip it up, you gotta zip it in the back. And then there is also a zip on the bottom. I got these because I wanted something that could be sporty, but could also be dressed up. And I figured with the slits and the zip up, this could be something that I could potentially wear with a dressier look. If I could ever afford like a Versace blouse or something like that, this would be something that I'd pair that with. Just off first impressions, I'm super disappointed with the shirt. I knew I was kind of taking a risk getting a women's extra large. I wish Essence would have said on the website that this was from the Versace underwear line. Like if you look at the the shirt that I got or whatever it just says you know Versace shirt and then you see like the model in it and it looks like just a, a tee I'm gonna save my judgment for putting this stuff on so y'all give me a moment I'm gonna get dressed and then we'll talk more about this stuff because you can only say but so much but I'm just looking at this and I just go this is not gonna fit how I wanted it to fit like this is not about to be loose so here are the leggings on and my fatness won't allow for me to close the zipper. I have been humbled <laughs> by these leggings, okay? I'm, I'm gonna keep the size because it's motivating me to lose weight. When I tell you that it was a struggle to get the zipper up, these are not very practical for that reason. 
So I'm gonna keep this just to have like a cute black tee. So I love the length of it. Italian sizing is significantly smaller than American sizing. A women's extra large and American sizing is quite a bit roomier than this. So I am now realizing that Italian sizing in general is going to run a lot smaller. Now that I know that, that lets me know that I can probably incorporate some men's apparel because I'm a huge fan of Versace. And maybe I'll talk about this more in another video, but my style aesthetic is definitely more along the utilitarian tomboy side of things. Street style, I didn't want something over the top. I love the fact that the logo's not big. I'm not trying to be gaudy. I'm super surprised with Essence that this is, in my opinion, an undershirt. Like when it comes in packaging like this, it's an undershirt. No, like I remember, and I still do it now, but the Ralph Lauren undershirts, I used to love to wear those, especially when I lived in Atlanta because they were like paper thin shirts. I weigh any given day somewhere between 175 and 180 pounds. I don't consider myself a women's extra large. Like I think if anything, I'm like a women's large. A 1012, I didn't know that a 1012 is equivalent to an extra large, but whatever, Italian sizing runs really, really small. I know that now. As far as the material and the feeling of the material, this is a nice stretch fabric. It definitely feels super breathable. I have a ton of room to move around and everything. I like the cut of it, like how high it is up. A big part of why I wanted to go with this particular cut too is because I do wear jewelry. So, you know, it's another good way to kind of accent whatever you're wearing. And also it, it slims the neck between the hair and this cut, it slims the neck. It's all about the illusion. So if I were to lose weight, this is gonna fit looser. It's not gonna fit the way I want it because I wanted something boxy. I wanted something, yeah, just, just boxier. This was something to add to the capsule collection that I'm slowly accumulating. The leggings, I'm okay with. I just need to trim down myself. And the shirt is cool. It's a great size for just standard wear. This will look great with jeans, leggings shorts especially during the summertime this this fit is cool it's flattering to the body i don't feel too weird in this these leggings are just rude but as you can see girl got back rolls like i have some work myself that i need to do but um that's how far off we are on this so i feel like if i drop maybe two dress sizes we'll be on to something <laughs> oh this is humbling <laughs> I know now moving forward that if I were to ever get anything else that it's probably in my best interest to size up as high as I can with the intention of maybe getting something altered and taken in because this is rude and disrespectful and I just don't, yeah, I'm not here for it. I'm not featuring having to stuff myself into some leggings. Now for the leggings material, it's definitely like Lycra vibes. This probably won't be the last pair of leggings that I get. They are also, super opaque i always worry about my underwear showing especially with cheaper leggings and you can see a woman's whole life sometimes in these paper thin leggings and that's not what i was going for so i definitely like the leggings it'd be interesting to see how these pair with blouses and things like that but i don't have a lot of that stuff in my wardrobe right now like you go in my wardrobe right now and all of my stuff are like basic old navy work clothes and i just want to get the the clothing right i don't need a lot of pieces i need pieces that i can interchange and that correspond and work well together but yeah we'll talk more about that in another video but yeah if you enjoyed this video let me know by leaving a like and a comment definitely let me know if there are some brands that i should check out and until next video peace Donatella Versace is like this big. I should have known, but I thought a 44, like I can't go wrong with a 44. Yes, I can. Yes, I can. My stomach just really humbled me, y'all. I'm about to go have a salad.